Hey everybody, so uh, today we're at a place called Tostarup. Um There's Tostarup Slot, which is a uh, castle, um, but that's not the reason we're here. It's for the uh, the canola field. <clears throat> and I'm sure some of you might know, but <clears throat> maybe you don't, that Skåne is uh, famous for what they call the rapeseed fields, which are the rapeseed in English or the canola um, and the whole countryside just goes bright yellow and it's a great opportunity to try and find some nice lines or <clears throat> some trees minimalist trees lone trees or lines and um, well today um, I think you're in for a bit of a treat this is just absolutely fantastic um, I actually came yesterday and I did some, some shots yesterday and I thought, well, you know, I'm going to come back and make a little film today. Um, so it's a nice day, but the sun is clouded over, so, um, you know, it's quite cloudy and maybe a little bit flat, but it, I think it's going to break up a little bit and you'll get some light on the subject. Um, but wait till you see this. This is, this is just gold, you know, it's beautiful. Um, so what I'm going to do is just get my stuff together and uh, and show you the spot that I'm going to that I'm going to shoot. Uh, it was just so good yesterday. I had to come back today and I had to to make it into a vlog. It's too good to miss. So let me walk over there and I'll catch up with you then. <laughs> So as you guys just saw, the yellow is just, you know, it's so yellow, it, it doesn't look too good in the picture, but it's beautiful to look at with the eye. Uh, you know, but we can deal with that in post. But you saw the line of trees in the background, which I'll, I'll show you in a little bit more detail a bit later. Uh, but you've got these tractor lines in the field, and the two outer ones kind of converge a little bit and you've got the straight line up the middle and as long as you try not to uh, in the edge of the frame have a whole tree on one side and a half tree on the other side which is going to sort of knock the balance and the, the feel of the photo a little bit uh, what I'm trying to do is to uh, I'm just shooting handheld my 7200 um, and so I'm trying to find the position where I can just get it just right either two whole trees at the end or two half trees at the end just to sort of balance it out uh, but uh, yeah it, it is just too beautiful um, so yeah let me have a play around and I'll get back to you once I'm, I'm fixed up and you'll see a little bit better what I'm Yeah, so shooting a handheld, I started off uh, all the way in at 200, just to get it nice and close. Um, but actually 70 mil is about the, the best distance because then you get the, the two outer lines, of the, the, the tractor lines, um, kind of leading you in with the uh, central line taking you right up to the main tree. Um, again, I can't, uh, I can't zoom you in because I'm shooting this on my an 80 miller, uh, into 80 millimeter lens. Um, but, you know, 
it's absolutely great. I mean, I mean, one two fifty for the second, so handheld is no problem. It's also this uh, Nikon seventy two hundred f four is uh, also vibration reduction, so there's going to be no handshake in it whatsoever. Um, I'm just going to have a little play around uh, portrait and uh, landscape, but at the moment I think landscape works best because then you get the the kind of panoramic uh, look to this particular image, which I think which I think looks best. Uh, but Skåne, you know, it is known as the Garden of Sweden, and, and you know, it, it, it is absolutely beautiful. It's a fantastic time of year. We're blessed with some really good light. Uh, all year round, in the winter, we can have magnificent uh, sunrises and sunsets, and you can shoot all day in the subdued light uh, in the winter. And this time of year, okay, you know, it's a little bit bright. Oh, we're lucky that it's a bit of cloud cover today. But this kind of subject kind of lends itself to any time of the day, really. Um, and it just goes to show that if you've got the right subject, the time of the day doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, I, I mean, guys, this is a real treat for you, you know. Okay, so that brings the end of the, the little film today at Tostero. Uh I got some nice shots which I'll show you on the screen at the end of the video. Um, but I think you can all agree it's, it's sensational. Spring in Sweden, there's very few places quite as, as pretty as here. Uh, so, you know, as I say, the, the results were kind of minimalist. Um, quite contemporary I think uh, which is a, a look I, I really enjoy um, but as always at the end of the of the video if you can just press like and, and leave me a comment um, I'd love to know what you think of Sweden uh, and score now where I live um, always great to have feedback um, if you have any suggestions for vlogs uh, you know please let me know um, it's always good to, to hear from from a fellow photographers and people interested um, but yeah keep in touch this week don't forget to leave that message subscribe all these things are really important to this channel uh, surviving but uh, it's a fantastic to see you again we'll see you all in the next vlog which will be in a few days have a great weekend bye for now